It's another day of vloggers, and in today's episode, I'm bringing you an update on my flower pillow. Stay tuned. Welcome to This and That with Denise Jordan. I teach women how to make wise home health and beauty decisions so there's less chaos in their homes, they lead healthier lives, and they feel beautiful from the inside out. And today, I am showing off my flower pillow. I cannot believe how nicely it turned out. But before I jump into that, if you're new to my channel and you want to learn more about running a household, cooking and cleaning and laundry and gardening, subscribe because I do videos about those kinds of topics all the time. But definitely check out the show notes and the links in the description box below because that's where I will list some of my favorite gardening and housekeeping solutions. Okay, so let's take a look at the flower pillow. I unboxed this flower pillow about six weeks ago and when it came one of the flowers in the center and then toward the back were just a little bit damp looking, just a little unhealthy, and they did die. But look at how the rest of this took off. Didn't it turn out absolutely beautiful? Now, look how strong and healthy and beautiful and full this is. So imagine what it would have looked like if this center part had grown up too. Now what do we have in here? Where the white is the Super Bells Over Easy and then the orange is the Super Tunia Honey. And what should have been in the middle was the Sunsatia Blood Orange. Now those are the ones that didn't grow. And the nice thing about this is I've had to do no picking of flowers off of it. It just grew like this and other than just watering it and fertilizing it every week when I do my others I didn't have to do anything with it so I am really pleased oh and then let me tell you this too uh, when it came and the center part just didn't look like it should I shot off an email to proven winners to let them know there was a problem with it and they re immediately refunded my money so I really appreciated that so the customer service was great and look at this beautiful beautiful flower and you know I put it in this container hoping it would get as big as the one that I saw Laura plant and it did this is amazing and I'll bring the camera closer so that you can really get a good look at it look at those whites and oranges and yellows are they not absolutely beautiful And here you can see in the back where the Nemesia should have been. So just can you imagine how gorgeous that would have been if that center flower had grown up? My goodness. But look at how the rest did. Just absolutely gorgeous. Now here's my question for you. What part of this flower pillow experience do you find most interesting? Tell me about it in the comment section below. And just so you know, I've raised three children. I've managed a home for more than 45 years, including creating a lot of gardens, and I'm a nurse by profession. So if you want to learn more about running a household, cooking and cleaning and gardening and health and beauty, subscribe. I would love to have you as members of the TNT community. In the meantime, this is Denise Jordan saying goodbye. I'll see you in the next video.